Panana Pa Kitchen, bringing Thai tests to your home. Hi guys, welcome to Panana Pa Kitchen. The menu for today is stir fried chicken cashew nut. If you like saucy style stir fry, this one is for you. The recipe and printable cooking tutorial is provided in the video description below. Let's start with the ingredients. For the flavor, we have brown sugar, Thai chili sauce, soy sauce and oyster sauce. I like to prepare my ingredients into separate bowls because it will make my cooking flow better plus an organized and clean kitchen. The rest of the ingredients we have here are raw cashew nut, garlic, water, onion, chicken, dry bang chang, chili spring onion and prick chifa pepper. Now we are going to prepare our ingredients by starting with chopping vegetables. You always wanted to start with vegetable before meat. This is to avoid cross-contamination risk. The best way is to have two separate cutting boards and always wash your cutting board after you're cutting the meat. You can get a clear instruction on vegetable cutting in the recipe. After we have finished with the vegetable, we are going to marinate the chicken by combining flour potato starch and mix them well together before adding chicken and soy sauce. Stir them well and set aside. To make stir fry sauce, put together chili sauce, oyster sauce and brown sugar. Put them in a little bowl and mix them well. Now let's get cooking. Add cooking oil into a pan and set over medium heat. We are going to start with a frying cashew nut. Slowly and consistently stirring until it turns golden brown. Next we are going to fry dry chili until the color turns a little bit darker but be careful not to burn it. It is quite sensitive and easy to burn. Next in the roll we are going to fry the chicken. We need to fry the chicken first to tie up the meat. When you stir fry, the sauce will stick to the meat very well and make it very tasty. You want to fry your chicken until it is golden brown and crunchy on the outside. Bring all of the ingredients close to the stove before you start stir frying. Add oil to the wok and set over high heat. Add garlic and stir fry until it is lightly brown, then add onion. If you want to use other kinds of vegetables, be sure to cook harder vegetables first before adding the easy to cook and the soft one. Don't throw them in all at once. When the onion is soft, add chicken and stir fry sauce. You can add a little bit of water to avoid the wok from burning and add a little bit liquid to your stir fry sauce. Lastly, turn off the heat, add a spring onion. The spring onion goes last because it shouldn't be overcooked. Spring onion is like a garnish of this dish. It is nice to serve the chicken cashew nut as a side dish and have with either steamed rice or rice soup. This dish has a perfect combination of crunchy, salty, sweet and lightly spicy from the chilies. Don't forget to serve it hot, eat it fast and enjoy it. If you like to learn more about Thai cooking, I provide you the basic Thai cooking class where you can get it for free under this video along with the recipe. Enjoy the meal and we'll see you next time. Kop kun ka.